Okay, hello everybody. Today we are going to use this template to measure two objects. Object A, which is an eraser. And I want to measure the length from here to here. And object B is a red packet, which I would measure the length from here all the way to the other end. Okay, so when you're at home, you can also choose to uh, choose any other two items that you have to do the measurements. Okay, so we are also going to compare the lengths of these two objects. So this template is what you have received. I'm going to begin with the eraser. Okay, so for the eraser, which is object A, let me write that down here. For object A, I'm going to choose to start at 0 cm. Okay, and when I look over here, the ending point is near the 4 cm mark. So, I'm going to say it ends at about 4 cm. And how long is this eraser? I'm going to count the spaces between 0 and 4 to let me know what is its length. Okay, so let's count now. So I have one space, two spaces, three spaces, four spaces. Therefore, it is about 4 cm long. Okay, now for the red packet, this is object B. I'm going to choose to start not at the 0 cm, but another number. So let's say I choose to start at the 8 cm mark. Okay, let's look where it ends. It is very near the 19 cm mark here. So let me fill that in. Okay, for object B, it starts at the 8 cm mark and ends at about the 19 cm mark. Okay, so again, I will use the same strategy. How would I count the number of spaces? Let me take this away first. Now I count from 8, 1 space, 2 spaces, 3 spaces, 4 spaces, 5 spaces, 6 spaces, 7 spaces, 8 spaces, 9 spaces, 10 spaces, 11 spaces. So each space represents 1 cm, right? Therefore, 11 spaces would represent 11 cm. This is one way which I can count the length. Another way would be to take its ending point, 19 cm, to minus the starting point, 8 cm, to give me 11 cm. So why do I minus the 8 cm? It's because from 0 to 8, I did not use this space at all. So if it was 19, I have 0 to 19, right? But I chose to start at 8. Therefore, I need to take away the first 8 spaces, which I did not use. Okay? So now, looking at these two lengths, object A is 4 cm and object B is 11 cm, right? I can say that object A is shorter than object B because 4 is a smaller number than 11, okay? And also when I look at the two lengths, just now when we looked at them, okay, I'll show it to you like this. We can also see that object A is shorter than object B. How much shorter? We have to compare these two lengths, right? So let me write it here again. This is 11 cm and this is 4 cm. How do I compare them? I would take 11 cm minus 4 cm to give me 7 cm. Okay? So after you have completed one round, you can go a few more rounds using different items. Have fun with your mummy or daddy or even both of them. Thank you.